Today I'm going to show you how to make quick and easy but delicious spaghetti carbonara. I've gone and put some uh, boiling water from a kettle in a pan. I've got that boiling and I've got uh, a knob of butter melting in a, uh, another pan. I'm going to get the fresh pasta in the water to start with because this is going to take two or three minutes. I'm using fresh spaghetti made with uh, free range eggs. Put that in the water. Bring that back up to the boil. That's going to take about two, two minutes, two to three minutes, depending uh, how you like your pasta made. The butter's now melted in the in the other pan, and I'm going to put in a teaspoon of ready minced garlic. Again, put in as much or as little as you want. If you hate garlic, you don't have to put it in. I love it, so in it goes. Cook that for a couple of seconds. And then I'm going to put in three or four finely sliced fresh mushrooms. And we're going to cook that in the butter for a couple of minutes. I was going to use some canned mushrooms, but I tried them out earlier and they didn't taste very nice. They tasted nasty. So I'm sticking with the fresh mushrooms and that's only take a minute too, I think it's worth it. The um, fresh pasta, the water's come up to, boiling, up to the boil now. So just give it a little stir at the beginning to stop the pasta sticking together. And that's going to come up to the boil, going to give that a couple of minutes. And then we'll check on that. And to the mushrooms, I'm going to pop in a handful of finely sliced cooked ham. You can use bacon if you want. Uh, you'll have to cook the bacon with the mushrooms at the beginning to get them all cooked through. I'm using cooked ham, so I don't have to worry about it. I can put it in there. that for another sort of 20 seconds when boiling pasta if you do put a lid on to keep it boiling do be careful don't put it all the way because pasta will boil over very easily right after about 20 30 seconds cooking the ham we're going to put in a small um, a small double or single cream. This one's a 150 ml container. And then we we'll season it with pepper. I like lots of fresh ground pepper. Some salt. All that a little mix in, bring it up to the boil, and as soon as it comes to the boil, turn it right down because we want a gentle simmer, we don't want that cream boiling over. Taste of cream sauce, the seasoning, we'll put a little bit more salt in. lovely check a bit of the pasta and that's ready as well I'm looking for when I test the pasta I'm just looking for a little bit of bite that al dente that gives uh, if you like it softer they cook it for a little longer Right, I'm going to actually go and drain this one. So I'll drain the pasta. 
That goes in to the cream sauce. Get out. And I'm going to have to season that. I've seasoned the sauce, but I need to season that pasta before it goes in as well. So a little bit more salt, a little bit more salt and pepper. And then last but not least, we pour in two um, mixed eggs that I've gotten whisked. And now we need to keep the heat on and then keep turning the pasta in the sauce and the eggs. And then what's going to happen is the egg is going to cook and coat the pasta which you can see going on here looks a little bit like scrambled egg and when your egg has just started cooking and it's coating the pasta as you can see there little bits coating it you're all done and you're ready to plate up this will easily do it these two people So you have quick and easy but delicious spaghetti carbonara, enjoy.